Hello, my name is Yonis Dijogli. In this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to build a 3D world. To get started, we need to go to File, select New Project. In this version, the version that I'm using at the moment is 2018, but for, for this tutorial, you can use any version you wish. Uh, however, you will need to make sure that you have already logged on to your Unity. It's free to create a Unity account. Now, to get started, we need to go to the uh, hierarchy. We're going to select Create, we're going to select 3D, and we're going to select Terrain. That's the first thing, we need our, ter our terrain. So you can use the, your wheel on the, ma the mouse wheel to zoom in and zoom out. So this is our terrain. The next thing we need to do is go to the Asset Store and basically import the standard assets or you can actually add individual assets as you go along. So let's go to the search bar. Let's type standard assets. I've typed it before, so it's there for me. So make sure you go to the filter. Make sure you uncheck the on sale. Scroll further down. Make sure you select free and then view results. Scroll down and this is the standard assets we are going to use click once and then scroll down and select import give some time until you import all the assets this time this will this process will take uh, a bit of time so you can actually pause this video and resume once your uh, assets have been imported successfully onto your project now select import Okay, once you have successfully imported the uh, standard assets, you can go back to the game. Uh, you have the scene here. If the, your layout doesn't look like this, you can always click and drag. So place your, by clicking and dragging, place your scene to the left hand side. Place your uh, game and the asset store to the right hand side. Uh, place the project to the bottom. Yeah, and place the hierarchy to the left and place the inspector to the right. Now, what you can do as well for the inspector, you can actually place them there like that. Okay, uh, we don't need the services, so we can close this tab. Okay, let's make this a bit bigger. Okay, now the next thing we need to do is basically uh bring uh some grass to uh, our terrain so to do this you need to click on the little brush here you need to edit textures and then add a texture we're going to click here select and then we're going to type the word grass here and then we're going to select grass rock double click here and then select add and now we have the grass rock here we're going to also edit textures again add a new texture select we're going to type again the word grass and this time we're going to put grass hill double click it select add and then increase the bro size make sure you select the the grass this grass here and then you can actually start painting over where you want the grass to be the next thing we need to do is select this option says raise lower terrain so click once my bro size is 100. Uh, now I could actually click and drag to increase the basically terrain. Okay. So if you would like to lower the terrain, you can hold the shift key down and then basically click and drag to lower the terrain. So without holding the shift key down, you raising the terrain. By holding the shift key down, you lowering the terrain. The next thing we need to do is add some trees. So we're going to select this option here and then we're going to select edit trees and then we're going to select add tree. We're going to click on this little option here and then we're going to basically go through and add some trees. So we have some trees here. So I'm going to select the broad leaf, double click it and click add. And now I could actually just click there once, click there again. It takes a bit of time, you know, 
so don't go crazy with adding the trees because your computer has to render all this information so i'm just going to select edit trees again and select add tree click on this little option i'm going to select the next tree available and click OK add and i'm going to add different trees there and again i can edit the trees add trees i'm going to add another tree available there conifer double click click add and then we can put some conifers there and there and there and this is how you create a terrain a 3d world terrain by using unique 3d hope you've learned something new today and i hope you will use these new skills on your project to create some great stuff thank you very much for watching i'll see you in the next video tutorial